Hi, my name's Max. Uh, I've been growing my hair for a bit of a time now, but it's time for it to have a bit of a chop. So, coming back to the lovely sky to get it all sliced off. Yep. Expert hands. Yep. Do your worst. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Max, so what are we doing then? So, obviously, we, we have been growing Max hair for quite a long time, like about a year and a half now, hasn't mm. it? So, um, but now you've got a job interview, haven't yeah, you? Yeah, so pretty big. We need to be clean and smart. We need so. to be clean and smart, but yes. also keep covering up the older uh, tattoos and that. So, what Max Max has already shown me a picture of something like a scissor cut. So scissor cuts, you know, it's a bit lengthy. It's going to be quite like a long, short haircut, which I like to call it. So what we're going to do is we're going to like wash wash the hair. We'll section the top away and we'll start work with the back of the sides. Still going to keep all this area quite long so he can still tuck it behind his ears. Still keep it a little bit lengthy through here but obviously not as long as this. So it's just going to be very textured, quite messy, quite free but long enough that if he wants to wear it as a slick back so keep it quite smart he can do as well. So with a scissor cut you've got a little bit more versatility so you can wear it in like a couple of different ways as opposed to just going in clippers through there. So yeah. With the back and sides, we're probably going to take about... Oh, I'm so sad to see this go. <laughs> I'll probably take about that much off, but we're going to really cut into it, so create texture as we go on through there. Through there. So when it drops, they'll still be long enough that he'll be able to tuck it behind his ear through there. And with the top, not too much, because we still, because you can see, it's slightly finer on top. We want to keep length on the top because it's going to sit nicely, it's going to weigh down. So once we take this all nice and short, it's going to look more like that kind of style as opposed to how it is at the moment being quite long. How does that look for you, Max? Does that mm -hmm. kind of look something like yeah. what we want to look towards, but then obviously kind of mess it up a little. So I'm going to start, I'm going to do a horseshoe section, which is what we do for general short haircuts. Um, but I'm going to start with the centre parting and then I'm going to create that horseshoe so it separates the top and then that lets, allows me to concentrate on the back and sides through there. You can see. Goodbye, long hair. It's been fun. <laughs> but I'm so like surprised how long it's gotten. Like. Yeah. It's just shot through. Like. The fact that it's gone from skin fade to that. In yeah. Eighteen months. It's crazy because you know some guys, some guys, it takes them ages to grow their hair. If guys like to wear their hair forward, I tend to go start from the back and work on my way forward to encourage hair. But if we want to go back, we want to kind of work with how the hair wants to sit. So we're going to start off with small sections just so you can see. I'm going to do it slightly at an angle as opposed to just straight down. Just really. So I'm not going to take too much to start. I'm going to take about this much off. So just working on the back now, so you can see. I'm just taking it quite low. I don't really want loads and too short at the back. We want this still quite long. So you can see. So what I did is I started up to here and I stopped here and then I came around here so that all this is good. we're just concentrating on. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just taking a section from the back of the head and what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to connect all this because obviously the top now is very long because we've taken the shorter. So all I'm doing now is just blending it so it doesn't have a massive kind of overhang. So I'm angling it quite low because I want to keep it long. All I'm doing is connecting that kind of the mid part of the haircut. You can see if you mess up, it just blends nicely now. I'm just drying the hair off, just drying it all back. Um, I've just put a bit of sea salt spray in it, just to give it a little bit of texture, to get that softness, that fluffiness out. Cool, so what I'm gonna do now is just texturize the back and sides 
through here. So now we've dried it. What I want to do is just clean. Just clean that first. When he tucks the hair behind his ears, he hasn't got that a little bit. See, it just waves out a little bit with Max's hair. He's got a slight wave to his hair, so it does kink out a bit. So I'm just kind of point cutting into that. And what I'm doing now is I'm just kind of cutting into it, which is called channel cutting. And this is a kind of more, just really texturising there. How's it going, Jack? Hey, mate. How are you doing? Tom, nice to meet you, man. Tom? Yeah. Just going to put some hair powder on. It's great for volume. You just want to sprinkle it on. If you're going to do it yourself, put it in your hands and rub it in. Because I've had the misfortune of putting way too much in my hair once, it feels oh, a bit too much. It just gives you a lot of volume through there. Kind of mats the hair up without, you know. Sorry? It's not too heavy, it's really light, it, it's great for like a night out. You can really build up on it. Alright, Max, do you want to have a feel, see what you think? Mm -hmm. So it feels a lot different to like a paste mm. or like hairspray in there. Yeah. Feeling good? Mm-hmm. Cool. And all I'm going to do, so what I tend to do is do the powder for the roots and just a bit of sea salt spray on the ends, just so the ends aren't too fluffy. It's quite light. So you can see now. Mm. It's a bit shorter because I'll tuck behind your ear, you've got enough length that you can, you can hide it. Hide it a little bit. Yeah, just it's a not obvious. Bit. Yeah. It's a bit more lengthy at the back. Mm -hmm. This bit kind of kinks out a little bit just because your hairline through here, but you can see as well. Yeah. Just like more kind of classic as opposed mm. to growing it long. Feeling this good? good. Yeah. yeah, you're good? Yeah. Fantastic. I'm a happy chappy. Now that you're done with this video, head over to our shop and treat yourself to some fine beer brand products. If you're not already a subscriber, be sure to hit that button and keep on watching some more of our awesome videos.